What's up YouTube? Welcome to the Beautiful Beer Review channel. Tonight we are back for another review. <clears throat> and unfortunately, I'm afraid this may be my last review for a few days. Um, as you may can hear, I have some sort of head cold that started up late last night and right now I can still breathe and I don't have any like sinus strains that's causing any sort of taste off or anything. A little bit of water in there. Um, so I'm going to keep doing them until I can't breathe, can't taste, can't smell. So this may be the last one for the week. Um, then again, I may wake up in the morning and feel better or the next day. But anyway, nonetheless, let's get into a beer. Tonight, we're going into Coastal Empire Beer Company's Coco Pina Goza. Nice little pineapple uh, pina colada there on the can. Um, I know nothing about this beer. Um, join the Empire... And, I don't know, November 19th, maybe the canning date? I'm not sure. I can't read it for real. Ale brewed with pineapple and natural coconut flavors added. Um, Coco Pini is a tropical take on the classic sour German style brewed with pineapple, coconut, pink Himalayan salt, and sea salt. Live, relax, savor. I dig this can. I've seen some other stuff of theirs in the, at the beach. I never picked up anything. I think my buddy Brett gave me this can um, before he moved. Maybe two weeks ago now, or a week ago, I think he moved. So anyway, let's get this into the glass. And I love pina coladas, so I'm really kind of hoping that's what this tastes like with that sour saltiness that comes with the gozas. Let's give it a try. can in the picture oh yeah so a little um, really light yellow um, golden color maybe um, a lot of light coming through you can oh I can read hop city through this glass on the from the back end you guys can see that got about a finger of bright white really tight frothy head um, looks really good let's get a smell on it And this kind of smells like a pina colada. Um, big dose of coconut coming off this thing. Um, big dose of pineapple. Um, that head dissipated super fast. I don't know what ABV this is. Um, da, 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 da. No ABV listed. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll look it up and put it in the comments. Maybe not. Head's completely gone. You see how fast that went away. Um... No alcohol legs on the glass. Yeah, it just smells like uh, smells like a pina colada. I don't smell any like really sour notes or anything like that. Let's give it a taste. This is such a fun beer. Hang on. <laughs> Yeah, um, really good. So the front end of this kind of tastes like the like the the milky part of a pina colada, right? That first sip where it's all that coconut and pineapple together, and then if you swallow, this beer takes on that really salty tartness of a goza. Um, it's reminiscent of what I would consider a, like if you were to make a pina colada in a margarita. I don't, I don't know if that makes any sense or not. But it's kind of got that, <clears throat> it's got that twang that, that a margarita has that has the smoothness on the front end that a pina colada has. I don't consider this an enamel peeler by any means. A good bit of tartness though. Mouthfeel is perfect for this kind of beer. Kind of smooth and crisp. Really clean. I would drink this on the beach every day. Um, I'm sure there are some really big fans of this beer. I have no idea what the untapped rating is. I don't know what the beer advocate rating is. I have no idea if the beer advocate people even reviewed this beer. Oh, excuse me. I have no idea how long it's been out. Um, gosh. I don't know. It's such a novelty. Um
there are going to be some people that, I mean, that really probably hate my rating of this beer, but no, I'm going to go, I think I'm going to go four. I think I'm going to give it four out of five. I really, really like this. I mean, it's so refreshing. Not exactly the perfect time of year to drink it here in February, but I mean, it's just fantastic. I will absolutely, when I see this on the shelf this year at the beach, I'll pick it up. I've seen it in the coolers before, especially around Panama City. Um, outstanding. Four out of five. Coastal Empire Coco Pina Goza. You can find this. I would drink it. Till next time, y'all. Cheers.